What's up, everybody? My name is Forgotten Sun 91, and welcome back to Ace Combat 7 Skies Unknown. Oh my god, I am actually having a lot of fun with this game. So, this is a lot of fun. And as you can see, that's, I'm continuing on from the mission complete sign. Ah, oh, this is so much of a blast. So, let's continue on to the next mission. Now, I'm kind of wondering if I'm going to be able to have enough to, uh, Purchase the next vehicle, so. Ugh, fingers crossed. Uh oh. The surprise attacks carried out after the declaration of war saw the peacekeeping forces of various countries, including Osea, suffer major damage. The ships moored around the space elevator and near Gandar Bay have been hit particularly hard. Numerous ships have been sunk and abandoned. Oh, crap. Fortunately, our cutting-edge aircraft carrier, Kestrel-2, was at sea, so it was spared from the attack. That's good. Kestrel-2 is now preparing to launch another attack against Arugia's capital, Barbanti. The aircraft carrier Vulture also managed to escape Gandar Bay safely. Awesome. However, it lost all its aircraft, so it's ah. Today, the International Union Peacekeeping Force reclaims its bid to the space elevator. The Fort Gray's Island Air Base Squadron will rendezvous with the carrier Vulture for a joint mission. All right. The first objective will be to seize air superiority in Choppenburg in order to secure a route for the support squadrons. All right. The enemy maintains air superiority over Choppenburg, so expect heavy resistance from enemy aircraft. There's more, so listen carefully. Right from the start of the war, the enemy has been deploying drones. Yep. They're using a new advanced type of drone. Ah, oh, come on! The airborne aircraft carrier, the Arsenal Bird, carries this new drone, MQ-101. The Ocean Army headed up the development of the massive Arsenal Birds and dispatched them to the space elevator to provide support. However, it's been reported that the carriers may have fallen into the hands of the Erujian forces. Great! If that's true, it could be a significant obstacle for us. That we need sucks. To gain control of the space elevator ASAP. Good luck out there. What do you say, Admiral or General or whoever the hell you are? All right. So from the lookings of it, we're gonna have four targets to focus on. Not a big deal, but as you can see, it's more likely gonna change within record timing. So let's prep for our mission. Aircraft tree. All uh, right. How much do we have? Ooh, I got. Let's see. Mobility. We're gonna go ahead and uh, get the cheaper one for right now. And this is my reason why. That way we can get it unlocked and out of the way. So let's go ahead and do that. Yes. Ugh. Kinda looks a little terrifying, but. Looks like a plane that you could see off a of top gun. <laughs> Alright. Oh, roll stability. All right. All right. All right. All right, long range air to ground missile. Long range air to surface missiles made for a cluster ground targets. They can be fired Safely from the difference to avoid anti-air fire. All right. Uh, what about? Ah, oh, god damn it. There we go. Target air-to-air -air missile. Air-to-air -air missiles that can lock onto four targets. Okay, yeah. We're gonna want that. All right. What's this? H P A A. 
High power air to air missiles. While high, highly damaging, they have poor homing and reload capabilities. Oh. So, that's great. All right, uh, machine gun, fire. Multiple enemy detached device. All right, we'll go with this. All right. Oh yeah, let's do it. Let's start our mission. Let's play with our new toy. Of course, it's another fighter, so I like having a fighter. Uh, we're gonna go with uh, target four target air to, to air missile. All right, let's do it. All right, <laughs> this is gonna be fun. Oh man, I am having so much fun with this game. I'm sorry, but I I love air. I love airplanes. I like aircraft very much. I can deal with you know helicopters. They're fine, but. But airplanes, downright love them. Alright. Why am I doing this again? Oh, does that actually happen? That's actually pretty cool. I mean, that takes like a lot of skill just to do that hey, down or get that down. Uh, Gollum and the other base of squadrons already joined forces and are engaged. You guys will arrive right in the middle of the action. Mage Squadron, eliminate all bandits in the current airspace. We have the upper hand, but that doesn't mean we can ease up. Good luck. All right. We got a lot of missiles this time around. So, I like that. More missiles, more chances to fire. All right, let's go. I want to go play right now. Thank you, lucky stars. Looking good, Mage Squadron. Keep up that pressure. Trigger time to show the other guys that we can wet wild and do dirty, dirty things. <laughs> let's go. Let's have fun. Don't let them out of your sights, even in the clouds. And so your first hunting season begins. All right. This uh. away, destroy. Woo! Oh, that's close. <laughs> Damn. Got him. Damn it! I 
this miss. Ah! Ah! Come on! Where are you? I might stall out before I can. Shit! Yep. I get him. Yes! Stalled out and got him, baby. Alright. Come on. Oh shit! Ah! I screwed up. I admit it, I screwed up. Ah! Boo! Boo, that was, that was boring. That was bull. Alright, restart the mission from the start. We're gonna go ahead and uh, skip that. Mage Squadron, this is the situation. Gollum and the other bases squadrons already joined forces and are engaged. You guys will arrive right in the middle of the action. Alright, sounds Mage like fun. Squadron, eliminate all bandits in the current airspace. We have the upper hand, but that doesn't mean we can ease up. Oh, what what the heck? No, no, no. Return to mission. Mage one, we'll that was weird. Mage one to Gollum one. Thank your lucky stars. Looking good, Mage Squadron. Keep up that pressure. Trigger time to show the other guys that we get wet wild and do dirty, dirty things. <laughs> Let's have some fun. Like Don't let them out of your sights, even in the clouds. Yes. Come on! Miss! Yep. Gotcha. Yeah, that's a hit. Ugh. Ah! Gotcha. Destroyed. That's another one down. Ugh. I want. Ugh. That's a hit. Come on! Yes! Ah, oh, fuck! If you can't evade a missile, use chaff and flares. Your fingers should still move, even if you're in a 9G turn. Ugh! Damn! Gotcha. All right. Come on. Four thousand meters in closing. Two thousand. One thousand. Ah! That was close. Ah, I missed. Ah, shit! Ah, crap! Stalled! Come on! Come on! Locked and fired! Destroyed! Our radar shows no sign of bandits. You're in the clear. Woo! Yeah! God's name is that. Oh, that's just not fair.
Does anybody have the feeling that this is Independence Day already? We just learned that Erusia is utilizing the Arsenal Bird. Those bastards. They had that thing combat ready this whole time. Enemy has a radar lock. Break now. Just waiting for mission command. Ah, come on. Miss again. That's a hit. Skeleton one lost. Skeleton two, take over command. Yes. Close. Skeleton two lost. We got incoming. Skeleton squadron is down. We've had too many losses. All squadrons, command has ordered a complete withdrawal. Leave the operation area immediately. Brilliant observation. They knew it earlier, or it would have survived the It's a miss. Ah. squadron, give our allies some time to escape. We'll go. But Gollum two is hit. Got to send her back. Let's get dirty, Trigger. You got it. Shoot down those UAVs. Don't let them touch any friendlies. Golem 2, head back to base. Gargoyle 1, escort Golem 2. Continuing the mission. Still got my wings. Trigger doesn't need to fill in for me. I'm back and I... You won't make any difference up here. Get back to base and clear your head. Ah! Come on. That. Returning home. Ah, damn it. Tricky little bastard, aren't you? Come on. That's it, Trigger. They're machines. Don't show any mercy. Uh. Leave the AO. Allies will hold off pursuit. Now, call him squadron. Mage squadron. Hang in there and come back safe. Mage 2, you ain't being down. Damn it. Missed. Wasted shots. Uh. Come on. Here we go. Here we go. Uh, and I missed. Come on, come on, come on. Come on. Come on. Or you may be yes. Gargoyle squadron, they might cut off your retreat. Come on. My status is fine. Affirmative. This is Gargoyle 1. Leading operation airspace with Gollum 2. Come on. Retreating aircrafts. Prepare for combat. It's a bogey. Gargoyle 1, Gollum 2, engage now. Attack. Ah, it's a miss. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Yes! Gargoyle 1 lost. What the hell? Gollum 2, status report. 
Come on. Just talk to me. Ah! Uh! I'm against MSU 30. Orange wingtips. I can't shake it off. It's matching me move for move. Go to. Stop dog fighting and run. Uh. Oh, come on. Mage 2, UAV down. Keep it up, buddy. Fort Grace aircraft. We'll let you take it easy next time. Come on! Get those UAVs off of friends! Get your asses out! Mage Squadron, you're going toe to toe with the UAVs. Good work. This one's mine! Come on! Come on, come on! Get him, get him, get him! Yes! All UAVs have been splashed. <sighs> Damn it! I said what I had to say. About what? Not a girl who'd retreat. Just not in her DNA. That was the right decision at the time. No, I should have never let a fledgling like her out of my reach to begin with. Golem Squadron, Mage Squadron, withdraw. I failed. It, there's got to be a way around that. But then again, I'm not sure. I think it's part of the story. Ugh. Screw you. You overgrown blimp! We have you on radar. You are cleared for approach. Runway is clear. Mage two, you are cleared for landing. Three thousand to runway. Mage two, lower speed. Mage two, bank right. Fifteen hundred to runway. Base two, lower nose, you're too high. You're past the guidance limit. Make a visual landing. Ha <laughs> ha! Oh god! Landing. Mage two has crashed. <laughs> oh crap! Oh man, maybe I should just skip that. I'm not Mage two, we have you on radar. You are cleared for approach. Yeah, I'm gonna skip it. Ah. Uh, oh man. Even though the mission is success, I feel like I failed. Unfortunately, the two front offensive was a failure. The aircraft carrier Kestrel 2 was sunk during the attack on Farbanti. 
Carrier-borne aircraft mistakenly bombed urban areas, and this has turned public opinion in neutral countries against us. Our own forces also suffered heavy losses. If it weren't for a few extraordinary fighters, many of us wouldn't have made it home. The situation is grim. We have precious little time, however. We have to get to the space elevator. <sighs> Damn it! I, uh, I don't know, I feel like I failed. I feel like I really failed that mission because of uh, losing uh, Golem 2, but I don't know if that's part of the story narrative. Uh, let me know in the comments down below if you already know, if that's just story element or if there's a way around it where I could save her. Um, I just, oh man. That pisses me off to lose an ally like that. I should have done better. <sighs> I'm going to end this video uh, right now to uh, gather my thoughts. I know the first moment I crashed. Okay. Yeah, it happens. Oops. But... And I don't know. Just the thought alone that if I would have moved faster, I probably could have saved her. But I'm not too sure about that as, as I, you know, I'm thinking about it. But like I said, let me know in the comments down below what uh, you guys think, whether or not uh, if uh, she was savable or that just uh, helped the story narrative. And uh, let me know in the comments down below. Uh, if you like this content, hit the like button. And subscribe if you haven't. It, it would really help me out. Not quite a bit. And not only that, uh, if it seems like uh, I'm getting too into it, let me, again, let me know in the comments down below. But if you want me to get into it like if I was an actual pilot, oh, hell yeah. Just... Let me have fun. Hey, let me have that, please. <laughs> oh, God. But you know what? It's... Ah, oh, this game's so much fun. I love it. Uh, this is Forgotten Sun 91 signing off. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Later.